coil. That looks nice. Oh, that felt. That looked really good. That looked really good. Okay, so you got the shot too much like this. You actually set up and hit it pretty well. So see right here, this is what we were trying to change. Your hips, that little angle change. Yeah. So that's how you're gonna be able to push. And so what you'll do is when you get it there. Good, how'd that feel? I felt like I got a lot more. It, it looked better to me. Pull it up, stay coiled. That was a lot better. Day one, what did we do? We did an evaluation, we looked, we introduced a lot of things and we focused on the full throw because we really want to get an, a sense of what she was doing. You know, again, body awareness is so critical for throwers. Or inside of my collarbone, that line, that's the line you want. I call this drill a simple elevator drop. Okay, heel up and push the hip. Oh. That's okay. So don't hyperextend it because watch, hyperextend it again. There you go. Look at the difference. Yeah. You see how your hip. That was a lot better. Good. You feel the difference? Better. Good. On the second day, what we started to do is break down our, our six pillars in more depth and we're going through our pillar connection process. So we're really starting to emphasize some mechanical details at the finish and she could really see again now understanding where she's been and what kind of position she was in and what she's doing. The six pillars again we talk about are really designed to help people understand and see the mechanics of the throw. Really understand what we're trying to do, have a good understanding of good mechanical positions and tail and how you're supposed to be moving. So now you can see and identify what's wrong. There you go. Over it. That was better. Now put it down and punch. Yep. That was better. That was a little better. Close. That was better. Good. You feel the difference that time? Much better. Look at that, that was nice. This is Dave and Nicole, came in from Saskatoon, Canada, and Sas in Saskatchewan. <laughs> I appreciate you making the trip, and I just wanted to kind of ask you a couple of quick questions. How you liked in being going into more depth on the throwing chain reaction system, what you thought of our three training days. Go ahead, yeah, tell me what you thought of it, it as a throw. It was incredible, like we did so much, we got so much done in such a short amount of time, we really transformed my glide. I kind of wasn't really knowing what positions to be in, so we went mm -hmm. through all the pillars, finding what position to be in and connecting it all together and getting drills to really get that hammered Good. in. Good. And did you think it was, you, you said it was a nice compliment. You accomplished a lot more than you thought you would? Yeah. Okay, good. And it was easy to understand, hopefully. Oh, That's absolutely. That's the whole objective. Yeah, especially oh. having you here with me to really like personalize it for my body and the way I move. It really helped. Very effective. It, it's given me as a coach very specific things to look for. And <laughs> I'll absolutely use the online resources as well so we can follow up. Breaking it down into the pillars gives us checkpoints that we can break the throw down into more manageable uh, bites. Yeah, it's really added to my toolkit to be able to improve my coaching as well. One of the things I'm going to point out, so as he comes in, again, we're trying to stay a little straighter. So I'm going to have him, when he winds up and we keep the hip straight, we're just going to have him 